The M10 Booker is a mobile gun system MGS, slash assault gun platform intended to serve alongside heavy armor, infantry carriers, and allied ground forces in an advance across contested environments. The light tank was developed by General Dynamics Land Systems GDLS, and is an offshoot of the Spanish-Austrian Ascot Infantry Fighting Vehicle IFV, detailed elsewhere on this site though evolved some by the company under the Griffin initiative to satisfy a U.S. Army Mobile Protected Firepower MPF, requirement. The end result is a more mobile, lightweight alternative to the heavier M1 Abrams main battle tank and the infantry-focused M2 Bradley IFV. The M10 Booker was formally debuted in June of 2023 during the Army Birthday Festival at the National Museum of the U.S. Army. Serial production began back in 2022 and first deliveries followed in 2023. Initial operating formations are scheduled to be arranged from 2024 to 2025 onwards. The original Griffin was tested with a 120mm, 105mm and 50mm main gun solutions and a hydropneumatic suspension system the various versions of the vehicle weighing between 28 and 50 tons based on configuration. The finalized 40-ton Booker tank carries a 105mm M35 tank gun in the front face of its turret as its primary weapon which provides a good reach against enemy armor units, fortifications, and dug-in enemy troops. Infantry can be dealt with directly by the coaxial 7.62mm M240B machine gun and low-flying aerial threats countered by way of a 12.7mm M2HB heavy machine gun HMG. The fully suspended track and wheel drive arrangement gives the tank reportedly excellent performance over rough terrain and can be used with equal success along paved roads. A focus has been placed on crew-slash-system survivability through advanced onboard detection systems, enhanced situational awareness, and optimal armor coverage for its weight. The hull is given a very shallow glassy plate leading to the hull roof line which promotes an overall low profile compared to Cold War-era IFVs. Hull sides are vertical and protected inside skirt armor, particularly over the more vulnerable upper sections of the track link network. The driver takes up a position at front left and his hatch features three vision blocks. Each hull side is given six rubber-tired road wheels and the drive sprocket is fitted forward with the track idler at rear. The turret showcases angled sides for basic ballistics protection and mounts twin backs of four smoke grenade dischargers to each side, at the cheek positions, for a total of 16 grenades to help screen the vehicle. The gun is fully stabilized and aided by a digital system for accurized firing at range, given access to all NATO standard projectiles in the 105mm caliber. The turret has two access hatches along the roof line for the commander and loader. Vision blocks are noted as are various sensor fits.